It's just sound, there's no performance. Ooh! 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 Hello and welcome back to Ashley Car Mart Reviews. After doing so many car reviews, I think it's only natural for us to progress on to car-related products and accessories. After reaching out to several partners, Sony has very kindly sent us some products. Ta-da! What we have here today is Sony's mobile ES system. What does ES stand for? It is actually elevated standards. And what this means is it is Sony's premium in-car audio products. Sony, as you know, is a brand famous for very good quality audio visual products like home theatre systems, noise cancelling, headphones, and now in-car audio accessories. And I've been driving around several days with this in the car and I'm going to share with you how I feel about them. So I've reviewed many cars and you can more or less tell whether a car is good or not. And in many cars, the stock sound system feels as if the manufacturer put it in there just for the sake of having sound come on when you switch on the radio. That is to say, it's just sound, there's no performance. And I feel that in Singapore, when you're spending so much money on the car and spending so much time in the car, a sound system is a way to improve your overall driving experience. So, spending money on a third party sound system. Some people will say, hey, I already spent so much money on the car, you know, I don't want to spend more. But I think there is a case to be made for shelling out the extra dough for a sound system. And today we are reviewing the Sony Mobile ES system. And we'll see whether it is worth the upgrade. So the Sony Mobile ES system is comprised of six products. A high resolution digital media receiver, two-way component speakers, two-way coaxial speakers, subwoofer, four-channel power amplifier, and mono power amplifier. All these products will make the oral experience in your car much better and improve the driver-centricness of the car as well. So when you buy a new car, it comes with stock hardware and software, and sometimes you might find it not to your liking. Uh, maybe it doesn't have Apple CarPlay or the Apple CarPlay is only on wires. Well, for the Sony Mobile ES system, it's a dedicated complete upgrade and for example, wireless Apple CarPlay and the system is very nice and responsive. Everything you click is almost immediate and I don't know if you can see this well, but it has a nice anti-glare coating so on a bright sunny day itself, this is very legible. And to aid legibility, you can actually angle the screen to your liking, but only during installation, okay? When you've already installed it, it's held in place so that, you know, your passenger won't be able to like smack it and then you can't see the screen and you're, and you're driving and then you're distracted trying to angle it back. Now, on to the audio experience. What can I say? This is definitely an upgrade over your stock system, um, obviously. Music is clear, there's a lot of clarity in all the words that's being delivered by whoever, whichever artist you are listening to. The bass is nice and powerful, but most importantly, when you turn up the volume, there is very little distortion. Ooh! 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 Smooth like butter! So essentially, it feels like you are at a live recording. It's definitely way better than a stock sound system. As for the head unit itself, it's the Sony XAV9500ES. They, they have this special feature called time alignment. And if you are confused as to what time alignment is, the explanation is here. So to explain what time alignment is, just imagine you're watching a movie and then this is what happens. See, that is very annoying, right? So essentially, time alignment allows the music to reach your ears at the optimal timing. So everything is perfect. And for the true audio files, you know, maybe you think, oh, 14 band equalizer is not good enough for me. Well, the Sony Mobile ES system has parametric EQ adjustments. So what this means is that there are eight bands of gain and Q factor they can play around for each individual output channel. So yes, that is true customization for the audio file. I mean, personally, for my plebeian years, I would fall back on the 14-band EQ system. But if you are really, really very into 
customization of the parametric 8 band EQ is very good for you. And one of the first things even uh, non-audiophile people want out of a sound system is the ability to feel that the singer is right in front of you like you're at a live concert or they're singing right next to you. Um, actually, that I feel that is a function of how loud you play your music. But with stock systems, when you increase the volume, a lot of times it becomes very distorted or muddy. It's not clear. That's why you don't get the feeling that they're singing right in front of you. And the Sony Mobile Ear System also employs the soft dome tweeters for its speakers. This helps the music up to the really high notes, you know, up to 40 kilohertz. Another feature of the Sony Mobile Ear System is the separated notch edge surround which has to do with reducing distortion and improves vertical amplitude symmetry. All you need to know with all these technical terms is that it reduces distortion when you pump up the volume. Smooth like butter! And that is what you want in a good sound system. And if you want the room-shaking type of boom-boom bass, you will definitely need to install a subwoofer. And if you are worried that you might compromise on the space inside your car, just take a look at the how the Sony Mobile ES's subwoofer is installed in this Forester. It is done in the boot floor, so it actually does not compromise the boot space. But that said, do check with your installer whether your car is able to take the Sony subwoofer. Why the Sony Mobile ES speakers can produce powerful and clean sound even at high volume is because of Sony's original speaker diaphragm material, engineered for high rigidity, lightweight, and low resonance distortion. Another reason why this whole system is able to handle performance at such a high level is because of its bi M terminals and gain selector. In layman terms, what the system does is it can identify the source of sounds that's going through the tweeters and the woofers and adjust it accordingly to do away with distortion. Now, it's not only just the speakers, there are also the amplifiers in the system that ensure that everything runs like a smooth orchestra. Sound test! My rear view mirror is shaking! Okay, suffice to say, it will go pretty loud and your ears won't be... I mean, I mean, the music won't be distorted. I can't even hear myself think now. So as usual, we have will buy, won't buy, or go try the Sony Mobile ES system. For me, the answer is clear. It is a will buy. Uh, first things first, the connectivity is great, there's wireless Apple CarPlay. There's something to be said about the convenience of having your phone connect to your infotainment unit in your car the moment you get into the car. No messing with wires, no need to take out your phone from your handbag or from your pocket. That is extremely convenient. But the thing that made me say will buy was when we turned up the volume of our song Smooth like butter with the Sony Mobile ES system. Everything was booming, but the sound did not distort. That was, to me, a life-changing experience. And I can imagine myself being in a car with the Sony Mobile ES system and pumping up the volume, especially after a long, stressful day at work. You just want to forget your troubles. You put on your favorite song, up the volume, and just let the world melt away. It's just you, the road, and the music. Oh, that would be such a great experience. And I wish you could experience it with me, but you can't through this YouTube video. So if you're interested in the Sony Mobile ES system, you should go down to your nearest Sony installer to find out more about this product because I think it really improves the overall drive experience of your, of your car when you install the Sony Mobile ES system. Yes, do you agree or disagree with my verdict? Let me know in the comments below. And also, let me know what other non-car related in non-car, car-related products you would like us to review on our, on our channel next time. So thank you very much for watching our review. I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed the Sony Mobile ES system very much. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel and follow us on TikTok. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye. The Toyota Camry that we have oh, here. Shit. It sounds like Julian is right in here with me. Ooh. Let's press, let's press. Let's press the button, let's press.
Yeah, and you all want to see inside? Yeah, every time I add lip, then after I finish the take, then you say I forget to say something. So, what are we having for lunch? What do you want? Uh, 